John Cleese, 82, has taken to Twitter to admit he declined the peerage he was once offered. The Monty Python star sarcastically said he regretted the decision. The actor posted the tweet out in full view of his 5. 7 million followers. He said he had never previously regretted turning down the peerage, a decision he made because of the British weather. John said, until now I have never regretted declining the peerage I was offered. But today I'm sad I didn't accept it. Because then I could give it back when that lying, evil thug Paul Dacre enters the House of Lords. Paul Dacre is an English journalist and the former long-serving editor of the Daily Mail. Rumors surfaced earlier today that he is due to receive a peerage from Boris Johnson. Fans were quick to jump onto the post and share their thoughts. At Allen commented, is that a news bombshell, at John Cleese? Until now, I thought I knew everything about you. At Helix Bananas said, if only I knew what peerage was slash is. It's too late in the evening to Google it. Sorry you feel sad. Hugs. At Pau Congo wrote, of course, there's no way to fact check this claim. Don't miss, in response, at a D baby said, if John Marwood Cleese says it, it's a fact. In UK democracy, a peerage is awarded by the Prime Minister with the Queen's approval and the selected person is entered into the House of Lords. John turned down the peerage in 1999 and joked that he didn't want to accept the offer as it would mean spending winters in England, he told the Mirror in 2011. The Faulty Towers star divides his time between England and sunny California. The actor is a generous donor to the Liberal Democrats and has appeared in several party political broadcasts. He declined the offer for a peerage shortly before Ashdown quit as leader in 1999. John said, I turned down a peerage actually. Patty was going to offer me one when he ceased to be leader of the Lib Dems, for political services, not because I was a wonderful human being but because I'd helped them a lot. But I realized this involved being in England in the winter and I thought that was too much of a price to pay. He also says he turned down a CBE in 1996 because I think they are silly.